Hello, welcome to AI Factory. TikTok riddle videos are making waves. Creators are producing countless such videos daily, garnering millions of views and earning money effortlessly. Today, let's explore how to craft standout general knowledge riddle videos for social media platforms like TikTok, Instagram, YouTube Shorts, and even YouTube channels. I'll offer key tips to enhance your videos and demonstrate how AI can streamline the creation process, making it faster and easier, even for those without any technical skills. Imagine this, accounts filled with videos, each amassing over a million views. Quite impressive, isn't it? Now, consider the potential earnings from various social media platforms. We'll dissect the formula for success behind these lucrative riddle videos. Let's choose one to watch. Riddle, what can fly without wings? Answer C, time. Riddle, what has a thumb but isn't alive? Answer A, glove. Riddle, what gets wetter as it dries? Answer B. We'll find those videos include captivating riddles, stunning visuals, an engaging voiceover, and seamless sound effects and transitions. Okay, let's get started. Step 1. Captivating riddles. First, navigate to ChatGPT and type, Please give me 10 general knowledge questions with three multiple choice answers for each. It quickly creates a table with the provided information. Step 2 an engaging voiceover. Next, we go to Eleven Labs, a popular AI voice generation tool known for its diverse voice options. I copy all the questions and answers into the text box. Okay, okay, so. In my younger and more vulnerable- Allow the world to- After sampling different voices, I select Adam and click Generate Speech. Within a few seconds, the voiceover is ready to download. Step 3. Image Generation Then, we proceed to Leonardo AI, an AI drawing tool that generates images based on your text prompts. After logging in with my email, I browse the creative images on the homepage. I click on Image Generation to start creating new images. First, I choose an image style by selecting Anime from the Category menu, click on an image, and choose generate with this model. Returning to the image generation page, I need to have one image, set the aspect ratio to 916. For the first question, which is about the red planet, I enter universe as a keyword. It takes a few seconds to process, but I'm not satisfied with the initial result showing two astronauts. After another attempt, I get a satisfactory image for my video. I continue generating more images based on the questions in this way, making adjustments or repeating the process until I'm happy with each image. If needed, the model or style can be changed or images can be sourced from free download websites. I review the original video which includes a stopwatch to time the sequence. I also visit a free image download site to find a suitable timer and download it. I will include all the websites and links in the description area below my video. Feel free to access them. Step 4. Video Editing This time we will use the powerful video editing tool, CapCut. You can use it online or download the application. Open CapCut and import all the images and the voiceover. Drag the voiceover to the timeline and expand it. Trim the space between each spoken sentence to tighten the audio. Adjust the timing of each voice sentence based on the corresponding question. Let's refer to a sample video. It begins by asking a question, then starts a timer and waits for the answer, gives the correct answer, and moves to the next question. Accordingly, We'll adjust the spacing between each voice sentence and add a timer between the question and answer, trimming it as needed. The background of the timer is green, 
go to the top right panel, select Remove Background, then Chroma Key. Use the color picker to select the green color and adjust Intensity and Shadow until you are satisfied with the results. Then, from the top left menu, click on Text where you'll see Auto Caption. Choose English and hit Generate. After a few seconds, the voiceover is converted to text and appears in the top layer of the timeline. Select your preferred font from the right side panel. Then, based on the question, drag the first image onto the timeline, adjusting its length and the duration of the question. Next, copy the timer and paste it between each question and answer. Adjust the duration of the question and drag all images in the order of the questions. Adjust the position and font of the questions to emphasize them, giving the text a shadow and background to enhance clarity. Now, refer to the sample video again. There is a dice icon on the top right corner of each question. We can add this too. From the top left menu, click on stickers, search for question mark, find the dice, and add it to the timeline. Adjust its size and position, then copy and paste it atop each question. Now it's time to add three choices for the answers using the right font. The correct answer, Mars, is highlighted by shortening its length, creating another layer for the right answer, and changing its color to yellow. Repeat these adjustments for other correct answers. After adding the choices, I noticed the timer was too large, so I selected all timers, moved them to a lower position, and made them smaller. Next, I need to add a sound effect for the timer. Go to the top left menu, click on Audio, and search for Timer. Select the first option, add it to the timeline, and trim it to match the length of the timer. The duration of the timer depends on how long you want to wait for the answer. I've set it to a quarter of a circle as an example, but you can adjust it as needed. Finally, add animations to each image. Refer to the sample video for inspiration. We can use a zoom out animation with a duration of 1.5 seconds. Apply the same animation to the rest of the images. Now, select a transition between each image to make it more interesting. Let's choose Sliding Memories. Okay, this riddle video is finally finished. Let's see the result. Which planet is known as the Red Planet? Mars. Who wrote the famous play Romeo and Juliet? Shakespeare. What is the capital city of Australia? Canberra. In Greek mythology, who is the king of the gods? Zeus. Which mammal is the largest animal on Earth? Blue whale. Do you like this video? If you found it helpful, please support me by giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to my channel. I would love to hear your thoughts, so feel free to leave a comment below. Thank you for watching.